Yeah. Uh-huh. It's the General Frost. Peace be from this video right here. It's about how I'm a self-made millionaire. And I will be a trillionaire uh, before Elon Musk in 2024. So I'm in a race with Elon Musk right now to see who's going to become a trillionaire first. And with that being said, I'm already up for apps for inventions. And for those of you who want to support, uh, you know, General Rotten is my cash app. But outside of that, I love y'all. I appreciate y'all. I'm building a nation. And um, it pretty much is what it is. Love y'all. appreciate y'all. Peace. Okay, you guys. I'm a, I try my best not to even give a fuck about what, what young pharaoh puppies be fucking saying in the comments. Always talking about, damn, why are you always talking about him? Like, that's weird as fuck. Uh, you know, all that other shit. But this is why, okay? <laughs> this is why, all right? This is why I do, okay? He say shit, I mean, that you, where you just can't just listen to it and just be like oh okay you know he be saying some shit where you be like wait wait a minute did he just say that i mean i mean the shit he say you cannot motherfucking ignore okay and he do this shit all motherfucking day long all right and that's the reason why this nigga said that uh he in competition pretty much with elon musk okay elon musk I showed y'all who he was, all right? He is a billionaire. He was the founder of SpaceX, okay? He's the one who just bought Twitter, okay? Twitter, all right? The, he's the CEO of Tesla, okay? All right? He got a resume that you that young Pharaoh can't ever in his life fucking come close to at all. So this nigga said that he want to be a trillionaire. He want to become a trillionaire before Elon Musk. First of all, Elon Musk, how you going to just skip from fucking a million dollars you said you had, Pharaoh, all the way to a fucking trillion? Young Pharaoh, Elon Musk worked hard and did shit you, you, to where he did shit to get to where he is right now. OK, you haven't. <laughs> <laughs> you haven't. Elon Musk is not finna get on YouTube talking about he paid somebody, uh, you know, forty five thousand, forty five hundred dollars, and you know they said they was gonna fix his credit, and you know what I'm saying uh, they scammed me, you know, uh, for I want my forty five hundred dollars back. Elon Musk, forty five hundred dollars is like four dollars to him. Like you sitting on. <laughs> <laughs> and what smart listen you got to be the dumbest person in the world to think that if someone say they can fix your credit you paying them to fix it is you serious that's the what everybody should know not to trust that shit now he's saying that they didn't take the shit off his credit nigga look i'm finna give you some game okay you better off disputing the shit on your motherfucking credit because they got 30 days okay to investigate whatever you disputing they not about to be doing all that all right some of that shit 30 days later they'll email you and say that they took the shit up off your credit okay i did it all right <clears throat> if you can't get the shit up off your credit then you could kill two birds and one stone all right by just making, doing a payment plan and paying off whatever is on there in payments. That way you could be building up your credit, okay, while you paying that debt off at the same motherfucking time. Halfway through paying it off, you can go and get you something like some jewelry. Don't pay it off. If, even if you know you can just pay it in full, get your kids some jewelry, okay? Go pay payments on that, all right? Then that way, you'll be paying whatever you need to be paying off halfway through. That way, you, when, you, when you apply for some credit for that jewelry, they already see that you consistently paying that off, okay? So they'll be like, okay, we'll work with him with something like that. They, they'll give you a loan for something like that. You start paying that shit off and, and, and paying it consistently, that jewelry, nigga, your shit will start getting better and better. Your credit will start getting higher and and higher okay you better off doing that you fucking idiot than giving somebody you never listen to a motherfucker who say oh yeah my cousin they know how to get your credit straight yeah you know and then out of all people martina niggas you serious out of all people you believe martina nigga you that's you gonna have to take that loss but going back to elon musk 
fool. You have not done nothing to even be in competition with him. Who gets on here saying this shit and actually believe that they are? Nigga, you don't even have the mind of him. You don't even have a billionaire mind frame. How the fuck you going to go from just being in the scrunchy young Pharaoh that you are to being well known like Elon Musk who buying Twitter and shit and the fucking founder of goddamn SpaceX and the CEO of Tesla nigga selling $3.5 million houses to people. Nigga, that's not on your rap sheet. Your rap sheet, your, we already know what your rap sheet look like. You know what I'm saying? Nigga, you have not put in no work to get to where he is. How do you even expect to even get to where he is or even close? Just sitting around talking about, yeah, uh, I'm going, I want to be in competition with him. I got these three apps and these three inventions. And uh, yeah, yeah, I'm going to need y'all, if y'all want to support it, just donate to my cash app. You think motherfucking Elon Musk going to be sitting here talking about donate to his cash app? <laughs> Do you really think that? Did you said that and then at the end you said if you want to support it, support what nigga? You not showing nobody no inventions. What inventions? You got the number three motherfucking apps in the world. What other apps you got? Cause you got that yo stupid ass um uh raps and music uh, app. Uh, nigga, you is not Jay-Z. Then remember, you were supposed to be, what happened to the concert? What happened to the tour? You were supposed to be touring the world, okay, doing these concerts and shit. What happened to that? Huh? What happened to it, Fabro? Yeah, because you, you know goddamn well, don't nobody like your fucking music, and you're not going on no tour no motherfucking way. <laughs> what the fuck? Nigga, what? Is you serious? And they talking about why, we, why I talk about This is why. This, and y'all motherfuckers gonna walk this nigga right into a goddamn psych ward. That's what y'all doing by really agreeing with him and, and cheering the shit on. Come on now. Ain't nobody finna tell him the real shit. This nigga know he not he can't compare himself to him. Now you could dream big, but it's one thing to motherfucking dream big and then but get on here and lie and shit and, and, and scam to try to get to the top and, and just be delusional in your dream. I mean, damn, I know God said speak things into existence, but he didn't mean it like that. I mean, like, how the fuck you think you gonna go from what you are right now to motherfucking waking up tomorrow being a trillionaire? Talking about by 2024. What the fuck? First of all, dude, you're not taking the necessary steps to do any motherfucking thing. And you're not ready to even handle that amount of money, even though I'm just feeding into it a little bit right now, because I already know you're not gonna do that. But nigga, you ain't even put, you ain't even taking necessary steps to even get to where he is, to even come close to him. Is you serious? And you keep bringing up, what did you do, nigga? You 28 years old and you just act like you done just did every motherfucking thing there is to do. And you just throw in a towel and now you retired because you done gave all you got. And you ain't even did shit. What the fuck? <laughs> And people are sitting here cheering this shit on. People are sitting here condoning this shit. People are sitting here like, yeah, yeah, you the man, you the man. They are feeding into this shit. Is you serious? You and Skis don't need to be in that house trying to think of something to try to convince somebody about a fucking invention. Y'all need to be in that motherfucker, uh, you know, doing science projects or something to try to come up with something you can show somebody who they what inventions you just keep talking about some motherfucking inventions. What inventions? Why would somebody want to support something that they not even seeing? You can't even convince. At least go make some up. Go in there and create some. You a schizo. This nigga spent all his whole day. He thinking of excuses and shit. The nigga uses all his brain cells to come up with excuses and to blame other people for shit. All day long. All motherfucking day long. You don't use your motherfucking mind for nothing else. You use all of your thinking, brain cells, and everything to fucking come on here to tell us that, oh, you know what? I thought about this. This is why this, and this is why that. And you really think that that's a billionaire mind, nigga? First of all, you can't jump from a million to a trillion. What the fuck? <laughs>
Especially you, nigga. Especially you. What the fuck is wrong with you? And what is it that he has done that's so extravagant? What is it? I mean, he keep holding on to the lectures he did, the the motherfucking uh, shit that he uh, taught and found out. I mean, you you just holding on to that. You ain't got nothing like you not here. You not showing us nothing else like you just talk about the in the university. That's it. You not her out here making no other moves whatsoever. How we know you not making no moves is cause we already know how you are. You can't hold shit, okay? Yo ass to get out here and tell every motherfucking thing. So that's how we know you ain't got nothing else. Nothing. You just say you got other shit. You ain't got nothing else. All these years you just been saying you had something and you haven't. Elon Musk not finna just get out here talking about he got a bank and he don't have no motherfucking bank. Like, is you serious? Now, Elon Musk can get him a bank. If the nigga could buy Twitter, he can have him a bank. You can't. How are you just going to have a bank? And, and these people are sitting there believing this shit. You going to have a bank. Nigga, and you asking people to support you on your cash app. And you sitting here complaining about $4,500. Now, I don't know where you got that out. I don't know where you crawled and got that little excuse for him. I guess you just sitting around the house. Because I'm just surprised that your ass just out of nowhere come out here and just start blaming Martina for some $45 motherfucking hundred dollars. Nigga, you need to be going to go tell her to give you half of what she made off that motherfucking porn flick. Yeah, if she made any motherfucking thing. Yeah, that's what you need to be doing. Getting on here talking like that and then talking about I'm in competition with him and I want to become the first uh, trillionaire before he does. Well, nigga, sorry to bust your bubble. You not. <laughs> you not. Okay. Do you know how many things Elon, Elon, Elon Musk have? Like, let's just say he, he lost his Twitter deal. You think that's it for him? No, nah, that nigga still the CEO of Tesla. What? You know the nigga put his money in many other million, billion dollar businesses. And you just sitting on here talking about this funky ass university? Like this dumb, and then talking about this the number one university in the world? Well, damn. Well, if it is, then why isn't Elon Musk a motherfucking student of it? <laughs> Why we ain't out here hearing other people tell us how good of a motherfucking university it is, huh? Why ain't no celebrities at this university, huh? Why ain't no scholars over there talking about the university, huh? Why isn't the university in the newspaper, huh? Why they not talking about this shit on the news, huh? Why aren't they talking about it all over social media, like the talk of the town, like Pharaoh University, yeah, yeah. Why are you the only motherfucker who get on here talking about the university, huh? Why? <laughs> Did that ever cross your mind, nigga? Look, I ain't trying to shit on whatever you got and thinking in your mind as far as your dreams and your aspirations. And But nigga, you're not taking no steps toward that at all. You're not. There is no way in hell you can just jump to where he is, okay, after everything he done did, okay, to get to where he is. You just got this funky-ass university, and you and you got all these lectures that you just hold on to like you were fucking doing lectures at the goddamn stadium and shit. Like, the tickets were sold out for these lectures, you know what I'm saying, that people, we could go back and see, like, the lectures you did, you know, when you went from state to state, that they were, like, the... Uh, the best lectures in the motherfucking world. You know, even you trying to make that what the fuck is not. Just realize it. Then maybe I think you will have a chance at saying, okay, well, let me start to do this because I'm kind of over-exaggerating with that. Because that over-exaggeration, boo-boo, is not going to get you even close to Elon Musk at all. 
the C the the CIA agent representing you too. I want to say that the CIA agent representing you and you keep talking about that. That's not putting no money in your pockets. <laughs> it's not putting no money. It, you know what I'm saying? You getting on here talking about you the leader of the black community. That that's not putting no money in your pockets. Yeah. You telling people to call in and, and, and give you all these compliments and tell you how, how, how much of a man you are and, yeah, you this and you was the first to discover that, that ain't putting no money in your pockets. It seems like you care more about motherfucker uh, uplifting you and, and looking at you some type of certain way, okay? Uh, it seems like you so focused on that, about your reputation and wanting people to look at you like this and that and you the general and this, that, and the other. You the first to do this and you did that and you was the first to, to really uh, to, to expose this. You, you, you just more concerned about that to me. Than actually taking the necessary steps to go out here and make some motherfucking mo make some motherfucking money. Take the necessary steps to you know what I'm saying make some moves, some big moves. That shit ain't fun to put no money in your motherfucking pocket. You just getting on here, uh, egotistical, prideful, talking about what you got, talking about your pool and your house you got, and you was the first to this and that. None of that is is, is getting you any motherfucking wear. Yeah, no, it's not. <laughs> Did you ever think about that? Huh? Did you ever realize that? So maybe you should start, uh, instead of getting on here trying to prove something to some motherfucking strangers, maybe you need to be out here trying to make some motherfucking moves, okay? Yeah, because Elon Musk, we know who he is. He ain't got to get on here and say he the first of this, he the first of that, and he's the one who did this, and he's the one. No, what he do is, it, shit, we know what he do. It speaks for itself. He ain't got to get on here and say all that. And what he, even if he did get on here and say it, at least he's saying what he could validate and it's actually him doing something. He making some motherfucking money from it. But to get on here and say this shit and act like you doing this and that and then still trying to throw in there that, that you the man and they need to respect you like that. And that ain't getting your motherfucking ass nowhere. You can't do that. You not in no motherfucking position to be able to do that right now. Yeah. Yeah. What's more important is you going out there taking them necessary steps that he did since 2010. All this, I was the first one to bring out the black power this and the woman is God and the this and that. Okay, yay, yay. After that, what's next? <laughs> what's next? My point exactly.